Hey guys, today we're going to talk about hypoglycemia. Should you increase or should you decrease your carbohydrates? All right, what are the symptoms of hypoglycemia? Shakiness, nervousness, dizzy, hungry, cravings, and you're irritable. Other than that, you're perfectly fine. Now, what you need to know about hypoglycemia is this. It's the high insulin that's lowering the blood sugar. Yes, it's true that your adrenals or your liver might be weak and it goes back down, but it is the high levels of insulin that is pushing the blood sugar down because the purpose of insulin is to lower blood sugar. When the insulin is high, it lowers the blood sugar. When the insulin is low, it will, your blood sugar will go higher, okay? It goes out of control. So in diabetes type one, where you don't make any insulin, you're gonna have high blood sugar. And this is why a person's put on medication, usually insulin. Now over here, type two, it's a little different. You actually have high levels of insulin in type two, but because you have insulin resistance, it makes it appear like you have low insulin, okay, inside the cell. So it's basically of all this insulin, but it's not working. All right, so now let's talk about the recommendations that you normally get from the medical community, which I believe is very, very bad advice. So you get this recommendation to increase your protein, okay? What they don't emphasize is to lower the carbohydrates. And they definitely don't emphasize to increase the fat. Now take a look at this. The real root cause of hypoglycemia is high insulin. Adding more carbs is going to increase insulin. We don't want to do that. Adding more protein will increase some insulin, okay? Adding more fat is the only thing that's not going to increase the insulin. Now, it's okay to consume protein, but only if you are on a low-carb diet. Because when you increase protein with carbs, you more than double the insulin response. You also get this condition called glycation where you're actually combining a protein with a sugar molecule, okay? And that's really bad in the body. And what's even worse than that is they're also recommending the six meals a day to eat very frequently to prevent the drop in blood sugar. And all that will do is just continue the problem so you'll never be able to correct it. So here's what you should do, okay? Realize that it's the high insulin causing the problem. And by the way, it's totally okay to, to consume protein. Just go with lower carbs, okay? Increase your fat. Fat is going to help you go longer uh, without getting hungry. Fat will help stabilize the blood sugars. Fat is not going to worsen the situation, okay? So we want to do a little more protein, a little more fat. You can do vegetable carbohydrates, but keep all the other carbohydrates low. And watch all the improvements that will occur with your hypoglycemia. So if you've personally benefited from the information that I put out in my videos, I would love to actually see your success story too. I put a link down below so you can upload your before and after pictures with your story.